Today we are going to demonstrate a bag fill operation using our Gillian Gill Air Plus pump. You will need the following materials for this operation. Any Gill Air Plus model pump, an output adapter, part number 811-0913-01-R, a tubing assembly kit, which will contain a quarter inch ID section of tube with an adapter that goes down to a 1 8 inch tubing, part number 800159, a Tedlar or Kynar bag with inlet valve, and we also recommend keeping the Gill Air Plus operation manual handy for reference. To begin assembly, remove the output adapter and the tubing assembly. You will then insert the output adapter quarter inch barbed end into the quarter inch end of the tubing. Next, you'll grab the 1 8 inch ID tubing and connect it to the 1 8 inch valve adapter. Next, you'll need to insert the tapered end of the adapter into the inlet block of the Gill Air Plus pump. The tapered end should not be fully inserted and only needs to be finger tight. You should be able to see some of the copper tapered edge between the inlet block and the flat edge of the knurled portion of the adapter. Attempting to push the adapter in further will damage the inlet block. Set the desired flow rate on the Gill Air Plus pump while in the constant flow mode. Ensure the Gill Air Plus pump is calibrated to your desired flow rate. Please reference the operations manual for information on calibrating your Gill Air Plus pump. To begin filling the bag, start the pump. The air drawn in from the inlet block will flow directly into the Tedlar bag. You may either stop the flow manually on the Gill Air Plus pump, or the pump will shut off on its own once it detects that the bag is filled and the pressure exceeds the pump's fault limit. The gas can be sent off to a laboratory for analytics or it can be used with a Sensodyne detector tube kit for instant analysis. More information on our pumps and detector tubes can be found on Sensodyne's website.